In another rage, Harry turns pale when General Gary reprimands him for violating the governor's order. Back to the fact that when Harry was honorably discharged from the Royal Army, there was a staff dedicated to him. In his book, Harry claims that he killed 25 Taliban soldiers who were forced to leave him. Because the government sees these killings only in the enemy, and the enemy sincerely thinks he is a human being. Killing people isn't the best part of the job, the preferred strategy is to save lives. Harry is not. The Invictors games don't seem to endorse killer Harry's slurs, even though he didn't commit any murders during his military service. Harry, who now considers himself an American, attended our warriors to observe and talk to people. Everything was fine until he started causing a scene in the gym with yelling and crazy jokes and comments. While they were there, Harry chatted with the US Special Gold Medalists, acting as if the Americans were interested in hearing the British Prince talk about his honorable service and overcoming his injuries. Both the time and the place were wrong. The general found Harry's secret conversations with servicemen's families offensive. The exiled king was criticized by General Gary for inappropriate behavior at San Diego. Was Harry drunk? Most people seem to think so, because it can be a bit intense at times, but when it's loud, it goes a long way and can be downright annoying. If Harry pales, it's because he thinks he can misbehave in America and still act like a prince. The ex royal mistook the US for the UK before commenting on our laws and demanding audio recordings and images. They wouldn't, because they didn't have to be here, and he took a break from the warrior game to give himself something to do. While Harry was busy doing other things in England, he made himself look bad and humiliated. Why can't Harry celebrate Father's Day with Archie and share a real photo of the happy boy living with his surrogate? Unfortunately it's not a lily, but somewhere in the US, or UK there is a boy who most likely won't be named Archie, but might look a bit like Harry. I sincerely hope Archie is in the UK and safe from Harry and Meghan. Drug use, in fact, none of the brave soldiers in our British armed forces interact with Harry. He treated the entire Marine Corps with contempt. Shortly after the wedding, Harry received the honorary title of Commander-in-Chief of the Naval Forces from Prince Philip to officially attend the Marine Corps Memorial. It was the first date on the calendar. Harry, an ex-soldier, had to realize that he quit his job to go to Disney's The Lion King and work for his wife. In one video, he can be heard urging the Disney boss to consider his wife as a speaker, while the Disney boss's wife looks on in disbelief at her upbringing. Harry was fully aware of what he had done and chose to ignore it, which is why he would never be able to perform royal duties or wear a uniform again. He is a disgrace to his family, this nation, the entire armed forces and himself. When it comes to his personal life, if Harry remembers the truth, there is little consequence. It was despicable for Harry to speak so openly on behalf of our troops and our country as our military refused to confirm Harry's comments, and many were shocked that he even made the statement. I also remember that this was explained in the press. These are also complete records of the palace, William also paid the game inventor the full amount of his phone hacking settlement. Harry will make a donation to Archwell, where he and his controllers are, and they will use the money for their own purposes. In other words, if he wins, only 5% of the donations to Archerwell, Delaware, will actually go to some charitable cause. The remaining 95% is used to pay administrative costs, such as clothing and fake awards. Whether fighting or not, everyone knows the code of conduct for soldiers. Harry is a disgrace to Britain, and his fake presence at Pearl Harbor versus the Braves really upset me. He has no spine and is not a soldier. He was all smiles, like a courtier, like his stupid wife. The winner's race is said to have gone to the royal family, with Mike Tyndall considered a good replacement. I hope this will happen, Harry also thought he could say whatever he wanted because he was still charming, but those days were over. The government does not see these sacrifices as pawns, as in his book. These were Harry's own words. 
Please don't tarnish my government and my country with what traitors call porridge. On the other hand, it's weird that the king doesn't know where Archie is. Charles toasted Archie's birthday on the day of his coronation, saying that wherever he is, the king's speech speaks volumes. Remember that the meaning of love and memories of the late queen can be different, because the royal family speaks with some real words. Not sure why the fantasy kids still follow. I find it strange that there have never been any pictures of the happy family, because it seems to me that Mel and Harry need photo opportunities. There aren't many photos of a happy family, except for a very few that blur the faces of the children, there are no current birthday images, Mother's Day or Father's Day images. Nothing. Harry's son's birthday was almost lost on him. He also missed his daughter's second birthday. Young children do not know whether their birthday is celebrated on their birthday or not. Despite that point one would assume that a birthday celebration would be in a big way when the entire family is there. Nothing though enough it may be partially accurate to claim that Harry and Meghan Michael act in this manner to safeguard and protect their children, but to show that it's doable, all they need to do is consider how the royal family manages to keep their children secure and protected while also allowing for regulated picture opportunities or releasing images of them to the public. Very perplexing like I mentioned. Additionally, he has inherited a funny quality from his wife, smiling while making excuses to no one. I've witnessed it a few times like at Serena's match when Meghan Markle's mother blanked her, but she continued to speak and smile as if she was having a terrific conversation. If you look at the photos, you'll see that Harry does the same thing in most of them. This happens quite often now. What if I express myself in a video? Feel free to watch my videos with your friends and also hypocrite couple for more updates in the future. Don't hesitate to subscribe again to our royal news channel. Thanks for watching and see you soon.